Hello viewers, welcome back. So today we continue with free energy exploration. So this time I prepared for you something which deals with kinetic energy. You can see the image, it's something a little bit different from other patents I showed on my channel. But the patent is called the Centrifugal Driving Electricity Generation System for Conservation of Energy. Yeah, by Chu Fu Lin from Taiwan. Yeah, it's something uh, very interesting. Uh, it deals with the kinetic energy and centrifugal force. So you will see uh, in when I'm describing in the when I'm rotating the patent what's going on there. But it's very very interesting. So without any further delay, I bring you centrifugal driving electricity generation system. All right, yours. So this is it. Chu Fu Lin. Uh, electricity generation system. So what's that? So centrifugal driving. So it's obvious, yeah, isn't it? Yes, it is. So we will have like these two vehicles. You can see we have some wheels on the on the bottom of these vehicles will spin in circle. Of course, not on the air, but on the ground, which I will show later. So because uh, because we have the high diameter from the center of this shaft, we need smaller energy. We don't need big energy to rotate this uh, this shaft in the middle, yeah. And of course, we have very high power in the middle compared to the power necessary to uh, for this to spin around, yeah. So that's that's the key here. So we here we'll have much higher power than the power needed for this to rotate, yeah. So, so that's the first logical step here, yeah. And and then of course, uh, for example, this could be like 10 kilowatt, 10 kilowatt uh, needed for this to rotate this middle shaft, and in the middle we could have like 20 kilowatt, yeah. So or 200 kilowatt, yeah. And then we have some loose, we lose some power on the sprocket mechanism, yeah. So the gearing, so the, the gears, we lose some power here, but no matter the, the loss on these sprockets, yeah, we will still have much higher power and higher speed because here is a smaller sprocket yeah, than the here. So the output should at least be, as Patton says, uh, the same power as the input energy we spent. But I think it will be much more. Yeah? So it's, the Patton is called the system for conservation of energy. But it's obvious that the energy produced on this output generator must be higher than the energy spent on this uh, on these wheels to rotate in circle. Yeah? So, for example, if we have 10 kilowatts here, I think we could have with the proper mechanism maybe 200 kilowatts here, yeah? or even more. We can we can scale this to megawatts. Yeah? So to show. Uh, so of course this will be the ground level and all this machinery uh, all the supports for the generator and for the main shaft will be inside the ground so this will these two vehicles ele electricity driven vehicles will be on the ground yeah? and of course the, we should get output energy higher than the input energy for this to operate because of centrifugal force or the force which is always smaller the higher the circle uh, or diameter is. So this is basically it. So until next video, stay tuned on my channel. Bye bye.